It's DJ Barbecue at the London Freeze Festival just off the River Thames. And I've got a slew, a smorgasbord of rad skiers and snowboarders that are gonna be eating up some of our tender, tasty biddles. The smokers in the back next to the VIP section, so let's get cooking. Candied pork tenderloin. It's got a sweet, sweet flavor. It's all the sugar I put in the marinade. And I've got Yerman Broughton to help me out. Yerman, hey. thank you very much. Yerman is one of the raddest snowboarders on the planet right now. His style is so sick, you can catch bird flu from it. He's got a smorgasbord, a buffet, a slew of ridiculous snowboarding tricks in his back pocket. So I am truly honored he's helping me out on the DJ Barbecue Smoker today. The joining meat that we're gonna marinade is the pork tenderloin. It looks like a big old ding dong. It's just a really good cut of meat. It's lean and very tender, and it's a big hit in my world. Let's get cooking, dude. Soy sauce, garlic, brown sugar. This is how simple this marinade is. We're gonna take our pork tenderloin, throw it in our bag. We're gonna do two of these bad boys. I need you to pour our marinade in the bag. Make sure the air is out. You seal it, massage that pork, now you could cook that right now, and it's yeah. gonna taste awesome. But if you wanna supersize your awesome, you pull it out of the fridge from the night before. Wow. This is gonna taste insane. Whoa. Let's put yours on, dude. We? Yeah, you, then you can actually taste the difference between an overnight marinade yeah. and um, the five minute marinade. Five minute marinade. <laughs> okay. This is gonna be awesome. Boom. High five Yerman, and you guys can like, find out more about recipes and other chefs and Jamie Oliver's things. Yeah. You just high five Yerman Broughton. You know, you know how lucky you guys are? We got a firebox down here. Oak in there, applewood, cherry wood, it's all working out, even a bit of chestnut. So we're gonna get this thing to 300 degrees. That's 150 degrees Celsius for all you modern Europeans out there. I heart pork. I heart candy pork. And Yerman's candy pork should be done now. So we're gonna open her up and have a look. Sorry, dude. Hold that. We're gonna cut up the best piece for myself and Yerman. Is that the end of it? It's the end bit. It's got all the flavor. You can taste the sugars, the soy sauce, and that garlic. Kind of gives it that more savory kind of, um, Mediterranean vibe, you know, that Italian vibe. It's so good. That'll get you laid, bro. That's that's a knuckle. <laughs> now that's where you can see the, the the smoke. That's apple and cherry and oak and chestnut all in that piece. Thank you very much. Are you jumping today? I don't want to give you, uh, you know. I'm jumping in a few minutes. Are you? Yeah. Okay. Well, good luck. This is, this is gonna give me the edge. All right, now I'm gonna give you a bit of the one that you did. It won't have as much flavor but it, it should still do you right. A bit more tender, but yeah. the flavor is just not as sweet and savory. No, that felt better. Yeah, do it the night before. Always marinate your candy pork tenderloin the night before. Oh my gosh. Good. That's so good. Good luck, dude. Okay, thanks. All right, thanks, man. Click on here. High five to subscribe, man. Not just me, but Jamie Oliver, that dude, and a slew of other chefs. High five to subscribe. Okay, okay, so it's raining outside and you don't wanna get your barbecue wet. You may be a wuss, but I got just the dish for you. Fish tacos. They rock my world. Do them inside, do them outside. Just make sure you do them.